steps to solve the problem are one, draw a free body diagram. Free body diagram is a diagram of the object and the forces that are on it. Any forces that are on it, put them in the picture. The second step is assign a coordinate frame. Generally for these, it's asking you to find acceleration. So you need to know what direction something's gonna move. In order to know directions, you need to put on a coordinate frame. So you might say X is this way, Y is this way. Usually X is in the direction of motion and Y is perpendicular to the surface. So then step three is write the equations. This would be using the force equations, sum of the force equals mass times acceleration. Do that in x and y directions, and z directions if that happens to exist, but usually it's just a two-dimensional problem. So once you do this, you need to check static and dynamic. So you want to see, does the object move? And then if it does move, we'll check kinetic. We want to know how fast does it accelerate? So then step four is solve the problem.